Greetings, YouTube. It should come as no surprise to those that have been on YouTube for a while what I'm about to tell you. Fiction is an outperforming out reality. How YouTube algorithm uh, distorts truth. An ex-YouTube insider reveals how its recommendation algorithm promotes divisive clips and conspiratorial videos. Uh, did they harm Hillary Clinton's bid for presidency? And I think the answer to that is pretty much a resounding yes. And someone else linked to something about um, recent development yesterday. Uh, YouTube announced on its blog that it will now start identifying videos and channels funded in part or a whole or in part by governments, say, for example, the Russians. Uh, said predictably, a lot of the comments on that article are conspiratorial, but what's always interesting is that people's conspiracies generally argue that the left liberal end of the political spectrum is privileged over everything else. So even though, as this article discusses, the data shows that the exact opposite, people still think YouTube is a liberal SJW bastion in George uh, Soros' pocket or whatever. And that's the, one of the major problems, is that I know that people are going to say that there are conspiratorial fans out there on both the left and the right end of the spectrum, but I got to tell you something. Of those two groups, the ones over here on the right are far more friggin' dangerous. There are more of them. They are louder. They are dimmer. They are more stubborn and more ignorant. So I do not deny the exist of left-leaning conspiracies. They do exist. In fact, sometimes you've got left and right-leaning conspiracies about the same topic. You could probably find fans of conspiracies about chemtrails on both ends of those spectrums. GMOs on both ends of those spectrums. All kinds of things out there like that. But in this particular case, the most dangerous types of these videos are on the right. Now, I discuss politics regularly. And some, some of my subscribers will tell you they get some pretty twisted recommendations because of the algorithms generating results from the video topics I'm discussing. I get stuff regularly that I just, I, I remove from my recommendation lists in the faint hope that the algorithm will learn. Don't send me stuff from like the white nationalists. Don't send me stuff from the, the anti-choice, anti-woman, anti-feminists of, of the, of YouTube. I don't want those recommendations. Just because I discuss feminism doesn't mean I want to listen to people who are misogynists. Just because I discuss the GOP doesn't mean I support their policies. Their algorithm is horrible or morals. And as someone else says below in this particular thread, that this is an unmoderated AI doing these algorithmic generations. We don't know how it works. We don't know its structure. And I'm sure the people that originally created it probably aren't 100% sure of what it's doing anymore. But it keeps generating recommendations for you and I. And they keep getting put into our, our, our recommendation lists. Now, as someone else points out, there are certain videos they open up in a private window so that it doesn't end up feeding the algorithm for their main channel. And I concur. There are times when I do not open things while well, logged into YouTube because I don't want that added to the algorithmic mix that they're throwing at me on a regular basis. Not to mention a lot of the stuff they do recommend, recommend are things I've already watched or from like channels I'm already subscribed to, which, you know, doesn't really help me. Those aren't recommendations I care about. Send me stuff I haven't seen. Send me new things and leave out the Hitler lights and, and, and the white nationalists and the misogynists. I don't need those. Really, really, I don't. I get enough of them in the comments. Um, so let's discuss our personal experiences with the YouTube algorithms. And do you consider that the announcements they're making are going to help us? Or are they just going to continue to further the conspiratorial right and its domination here on YouTube?